All right, Pat. See you later tonight, Pat. That's it. He's actually here, too. Um, we know you're a big sports fan. Everybody knows that. And our producer, Shelly Kilburn, has uh, tracked down a couple of your favorite sports celebrities. First of all, Ty of course. Uh, what's that guy's name that I was so in love with? Uh, that would be Nick Saban. No, no. Oh, uh, oh my God. Ooh. Todd, uh, what? The, the Dallas quarterback. <laughs> Cut out of Troy Aikman in the newsroom with a Hawaiian lay around. It made for good for good. Uh, it, when it was cold at night, I would take that cut out picture. And <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Todd Aikman, ladies and oh gentlemen. Oh my goodness! Thank, is that really his signature? That's really Troy Aikman's signature and really Nick Saban's signature. <gasps> Okay, for $5,000, you can get this Troy Aikman signature call now. You know, I, oh we wanted God. to get Troy on the show, but he's currently scouting out the slopes in the Rockies before your arrival. He's actually skiing right now in Is the Rockies. Really? You might bump into him on the slopes when you're there. Well, you know what? Both of these men are now happily married and have children and all that kind of stuff. But no matter who would come into my life, I am, I am hooked on my Amazing fiance. how you forget yes. about all this yes. when the right guy comes along. It's like Nick who Nick and who? Todd who. <laughs> I have James and I'm happy and it's like it's obvious yeah. it is but those will be nice little mementos awesome. for your wall with oh, your best dress picture goodness. and the proclamation from the governor it is this All is right. great thank you don't go away <laughs> there's so much more to do this morning at 6 41 Jim May continues after this Bum, 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 bum. Do you know the way to San Jose? I've been away so long. No. I've been away. Dun, 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 dun. Do <laughs> one more dance with you, oh, my love. Or can I just make some more? You've visited mm -hmm. over the years. Yes, it has been. Anna. Well, let's check it out, see what's happening in the garden, Marshall. That's what he wants to Well, say goodbye to Deborah. That's well, why yes, I wanted to get yeah. you on the you show. Know, uh, uh, I didn't realize until this morning I turned TV on that you were actually leaving. Because you, know, watch you left seven that. times before and you never actually left town. <laughs> but is this for real this time? Is that correct? This is for real. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're, we're moving to Denver and mm -hmm. I'm getting married and all that mm -hmm. kind of stuff. And, you know, my fish report is I caught the big one, if yes, you know she, what I mean. Yes, I did. Yes, she I did catch the big one. Did you meet James? Very nice job. Several people tried to hug me on the way in. Was he one of them? He was one of them. He's got four boats. So Whoa. we're going to, we're nice going to Denver, baby. Nice he does guy. a lot of saltwater fishing up in the Denver area. Uh, oh, yes? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Big boat area. Well, thanks for coming in and well, saying goodbye. Uh, yeah, listen, Denver. and we, uh, we go back a long way, you remember? We do. Well, I mean, I mean a long oh, way. Oh, hold on just a way. second. We have video? <laughs> yeah, we do. Uh, I guess we, uh, when I first came to TV3, yeah. uh, you were already here. Of course, mm -hmm. you've been here since Moby years. Dick was a minnow. You know? Yeah, that's yeah. true. Very good fishing analogy. I like that fishing analogy. Jim, I think you're about run out of time. Bill, this is the kind of guy that... We have on the show now here yes. on GMA. I, I, I cleaned up the act. Clean up the act. Yeah, That's sure. Excellent. We it's want to know your you, It's good oh. that you know he's a constant for the Friday edition yes. of Good Morning Acadiana. It really is. We're gonna, we're gonna miss you. Miss you. We gonna miss you when you went to noontime. Yeah. That would be we six and ten. <laughs> and and Jim, <laughs> <laughs> and Jim, that was eleven o'clock when you went. Can't be no worse than Todd. I want you to take a look at this clip right now. We're coming right back. Fishing with Jim Smart, and we have some gardening tips. Yeah, all of that. Yeah. So join us on the big show Friday. Friday, 5.30, get smart. What is your problem? No, that's good. <laughs> Perfect. That is great. We Men love <laughs> leather. What is it? It gets you all excited and happy, you know? Telling you. Ask Tom. He's the expert. That's his anyway, right? <laughs> We are looking at the pollen count this morning. Ooh, yeah, it's better. Yeah, it's better. Yeah, yeah, it's better. Have to back up a little bit. But actually, let's bring the flowers up right now. Come on up. And uh, you are, ladies and gentlemen, Deborah. Deborah. On behalf Teresa. of Martha and Tom Day from Tesh, oh. which is one of your favorite places oh, yeah. to shop. Yeah, Look. and you know that. Thank you. <laughs> Tom, Very congratulations to you. Oh, we beautiful. want you to know that you are taking our oh. diva. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Thank you so much, Teresa you from Tesh. Oh, that's nice of the days to do this. This is the man that's stealing our Deborah from us, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, don't say that. He's a real nice guy. He stole my heart. His that's name all. is James Stewart. <laughs> and sitting next to James is the woman who, in, well, well, she invited him into us. her heart. She's a real bad one. Marilyn <laughs> Lee. So James, uh, James, congratulations, man. First of all, Thank we're you. very, we're going to miss her, but uh, we know she's in good hands. Sure. Yeah. Well, that's it for James. <laughs> a big talker, huh? That's what turned you on to him. Talks a lot. How did they meet? Well, you've been knowing maybe James? Uh, we've known James for about 15 years. Uh -huh. and he came, he graduated of Ole Miss. Yeah. Came down for the LSU Ole Miss game, invited Deborah to come with us, and mm -hmm. we all four went to the game together, and what can I say? Love at first magic. sight. It was magic. What turned you on about Deborah the first <laughs> time? <laughs> I think that's an appropriate question, and even if it's not, I'm going to ask it. 
What was the first thing that attracted you to Miss Terrabile? Well, she was really embarrassed about the condition of her house. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, finally. I finally was. she sold it, you know. Yeah, but she was a pretty good sport about yeah. the football game, mm -hmm. and we were doing pretty good until there was some interception or something yeah, towards yeah. the end. Those Ole Miss yeah. people, they still, yeah. they think that, you know, they should always win against LSU. What attracted you? I sound like James uh, Lipton. What, what attracted you to, uh, to James? I just thought he was so sweet. I mean, he was just so sweet. I, I can't, I, you know, just he just had the cutest little face, and I just don't think he's Let's get a close up of that oh. cute little face, could we? I mean, I, I've never Look, had. Look, Chad. <laughs> now, is this a darling couple? Oh wow. But I have to tell you, when when Marilyn said, I, I just want you to meet him, I kept saying, Look. He can come to the game with us. Mm -hmm. He can sit in the car. He can sit in the seats. But this is not a date. This is not a setup. You make sure he knows that because he's just this low life engineer. With I mean, I just went off. Joe the Rock. This is what turned her around, ladies and gentlemen. This ring right here. But I can tell you that when the door opened and Marilyn, had, he was standing like behind Marilyn. My heart really mm. just went pitter patter. And I was yeah. like, well, maybe it was, maybe it was just. It wasn't too much. Refreshment no, at the game. Right? And, I, and, I, and then, um, and then, like, really, within 24 hours, we had, and then within 48 hours, we were. <laughs> and in another, in another 48 hours, they'll be married. <laughs> okay. So anyway, right. but you know, the number one question is, when are you all getting married? When are you? We are. Married? We're trying to, as I said earlier, we're trying to do everything one step at a time, and we're moving to Denver, and mm -hmm. then we're going to get married. We're just going to run off and um, not tell anybody. No, it won't be Vegas. It'll be somewhere along the water. The Thank you very much, Tom. Good, good choice. I told you. him, don't He's say much guy. because you will just... We're you, coming right yeah, back. You'll make fun of him. Forever. Stay with us. Well, I'm not leaving yet. I don't, no, I'm the one who's dead around here. I just, I, I just wow, want to let you this. know that the years that I spent with you on the morning show, I had so much fun. I, I, as you could see, I was truly myself in the morning show, and um, I just wanted to put together a little oh, reminiscent of our this. time together, friends, mm. family, and you and Bonnie have truly been my family. You've helped me through some very difficult times, and I so appreciate it. Well, thank thank you. you. I love you. That's I love so you too, sweet. Scott. I can't top that. Well, you know, this picture, can I tell you how crazy, you look at this picture. This one, Tom wanted to take a picture of what I look like underneath oh, the desk. Legs. This is what, I, oh, this is what I look like when I'm sitting down, this picture right here. You took that, you crazy fool. I'm going to put something <laughs> over that, too. Oh, there, so, I have a KATC sticker. So that's for you, John. Thank you, baby. I You're welcome. Okay, baby. Scotty boy. Okay. Hey, good hey, morning. How are you? <laughs> Scott, Julie, Eric, and Pat, all of them oh, my, my from the night crew and weekends. Okay. My, life, my yeah. live funeral, I feel like it. <laughs> <laughs> this is how much you mean to me. I wore sh pants that have the knees ripped Those up. Are, that's, that's how what, much I care. That's in fashion. Well, that's when you're dressing in the dark and you don't want to wake Sophia. I understand dressing in the dark. I did it for five years on the morning show. <laughs> you know, you, you, the other part of your family, us in the evening. All I can say is every time I think of you leaving, it's like um, good wives are hard to find. Both real and professional. <laughs> and, you know, to find someone who finishes a thought, who likes to talk over me on occasion. One minute, Mr. Brazda. One yeah. minute. Um, I did it last night. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and then, you know, Julie's going, he's red. I go, yeah, everyone thinks it's my fault. It was my fault. It was my fault last night that I talked but, over uh, you. I've talked over you. Too. <laughs> we got to join the network. You better hurry up. Give her the flowers. Oh, yeah. Julie? Thank Say goodbye. You. We're going to miss her so much. Yeah. Absolutely. Eric? We just want to wish uh, you and James the best. And thank, and thank you. you for making uh, Elizabeth and I so welcome to the community when we and first met. Pat, you're mean to Pat. <laughs> Good luck, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> James, well, you did a great that. woman there. We're proud of you two. You will make a wonderful, loving couple. And we want you to come back and visit us again. You know I will. And yeah. everybody's welcome to come visit us in Denver, Colorado. We'll give you a <laughs> Yay, road trip to New York. Ladies and gentlemen. And Tepra. <laughs> Take care, everyone.